Hi everyone, this is Johan from Real Biomes. If you don't know much about us or what we do, feel free to check out our website, links in the description below. But in a nutshell, we create the highest quality biomes available to purchase for Unreal Engine 5.3. It's an easy drag and drop solution made to work out of the box while giving you all the tools necessary to generate your own virtual worlds using all the latest tech such as Nanite, Lumen and virtual shadow maps. With that out of the way, in this first of many tutorials slash introduction videos, I want to showcase our biomes in a more practical sense and give you an idea of what working with real biomes actually looks like. Alright, so let's get started. Once you downloaded and extracted your real biomes project, you will see it comes in a project-like format. This is beneficial to us because we are able to include certain functionality in our project such as having a custom character blueprint that includes features like footstep sounds, ambient environmental sounds, camera effects, and will just generally give you a much better and more immersive experience when running around in first person compared to using the default first person template. Another thing it allows us to do is play around with the config files. So if you head over to your config folder, you will mainly want to pay attention to the default engine.ini as it contains a ton of useful optimization, tweaks, um, generally just a huge library of command variables that in some cases significantly improve not only the performance but also the visuals of the environment over Unreal Engine's default state. A word of warning however, we do not recommend blindly copy pasting this default engine file into an existing project as it may break compatibility with existing assets that you are using or it may cause other issues with your project. Now say you wanted to incorporate all of the real biomes assets into your own existing project. Very simple, all you have to do is copy the real biomes folder found in the content folder of our project and then paste it into the content folder of your own project. All right, so let's finally launch the project and have a look. Okay, so here you can see our overview map. Everything from pre-made assemblies you can just copy and paste into your scene to speed up composition, to roads, mudslides, rocks, trees, cliffs, grass, and more. Basically everything you need to generate your own fully featured pine forest environment. You can also use our spline tool which allows you to quickly and seamlessly draw assets along a spline while also deforming the geometry. Very useful for objects like cliffs and mudslides. Make sure to check out the biome painter examples in our overview map as they will help you better understand how to get going with creating your own worlds from scratch. We also include our RB manager blueprint a tool that you drag and drop into your level that allows you to control many aspects of your environment such as scene optimization, wind, foliage interactivity, autumn, snow and more. Anyways, that's it for this short introduction. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below or get in touch with us through our other channels linked in the description. Feel free to join our Discord community if you want to interact with us or if you have any specific topics you would like us to cover in a future video. We would love to hear your feedback.